So before my audio cast and my video cast was interrupted, we were talking about two important topics. One of them is financial abuse. Financial abuse is when someone says, you may use this money and it's for this, but then they come back and pretend to be funny about it, acting as if they have the right to do something in terms of physical harm, legal harm, or theft from someone's property while they're not around. Second, we have something called legal abuse. Legal abuse is when someone tries to create as many records as they can about someone's name or someone's legal name or someone's nickname in a community. It's a form of gaslighting, you see, and gaslighting is when a bunch of people try to set someone off. My question about the video that you'll find in my channel a little later today is exactly how many police officers are required to make a call during the morning hours. We literally had about four vehicles on the street here, and my question is, why? Under what guise did they come here? How quickly did they make it here? Where were they stationed before this incident allegedly occurred? And why was it a matter of five minutes before they arrived? My belief is that they had a plan to do other things today, I'm pretty sure. But when immoral and illegal and unlawful fraudulent employees misrepresent their company and their positions, there is a legal issue that those corporations need to consider. That at no time were their employees ever threatened by someone simply humbly waiting for a shop to open to make purchases.